Oh my god. You're making out with your roommates at our wedding? Are you kidding me right now, Alice? <gasps> hey, hey everyone. Welcome back to the Not So Berry series episode 13 of the Rose Generation. Now, today is a very special day. Are you ready? Did you come dressed very well? Because we all know Garnet has high expectations and high standards for her wedding. Hope you're wearing your best. I'm just kidding. Wear whatever you like, but it is time for the wedding. We're going to do some planning. I already got the outfits ready and I'm very excited. Unfortunately, at the time of me recording this, it is before the official wedding pack is out, so I will not have all that fun stuff coming out in the next few days, but that's okay. I think we all know that in the Rose Shen, there's going to be two weddings. All right, so I think I had decided that I would like to do the wedding tomorrow, so I'm very excited for that. Oh, look, and Alice is right here. Hey, Alice, let's tell her. Oh, she just literally disappeared right in front of my eyes. I honestly don't know what just happened. <laughs> that was interesting. Um, Some people love art, but everyone loves a popular artist. No, I no. I'm a politician. Good, sir. I thank you, though. Oh my god, what are you doing? Garnet, you can't just kiss him in the hallway. Girl. Well, uh, you're getting married tomorrow. That's not okay. Also, Saffron, did you finish your homework? You did. Okay, good job. Proud of you, bestie. Anyways, let's go work on our charisma a little bit, only because for our next promotion, we need to get to charisma level eight, and I think we're so close. Like, yeah, we're at 99%. And done. The romance festival's in town, but I don't really want to go to it. I want to, like, just make sure we're ready for the wedding tomorrow. I think that means I'm going to have to cook a wedding cake, by the way. Can I even do that? Yeah, okay, I can. I'm going to do a white and black cake. And then Saffron. I also got Saffron on an outfit. I can't wait for y'all to see it. It's so cute. She looks like a little princess. Okay, you know what? You can watch some TV, kiddo. You're doing well. The only thing I would like you to do is get your social up to level four, but we might be able to do that tomorrow at the wedding. Oh no, Wayne's inviting us to the, oh, the romance festival. I really want to go. How about instead we'll invite him over here? Maybe it would be good for his daughter to have him come over for a little bit. He could like come play games with us. We have a gaming console now. Are we going to invite him to our wedding besties? Is that a bad idea? All right, Sapphire just called him over so I think he's coming. Invite in and then beg for new toys. Hi Wayne, it's good to see you. Let's talk to him about school and stuff. I feel like he's a good dad. You know, he was just kind of not ready when he was younger but now he's kind of growing into it and he's like actually he really cares for Saffron. Let's talk about toys and then maybe we can invite him to come play with us. Multiplayer game with Wayne. Yeah, while well, mom's cooking. Oh, hey Garnet, I've been thinking about getting to know this person a little better. Do you think the two of us should hang out? Um... I don't know. I don't care what you do. <laughs> do whatever makes you happy, I guess. Go play games with your dad. What are you doing, Saffron? He came all the way over here. This is adorable. I'm gonna cry at how cute this is. They're spending quality time together. That makes me so happy. Garnet's probably watching this and just grateful that, you know, Wayne's being a good father because she's not the best mother herself. So this probably takes a lot of pressure off of her. All right, we're making the cake for tomorrow's wedding. We should probably tell Wayne about it. Add wedding topper. I can't forget this tomorrow, besties. If you let me forget at this we're gonna have an issue all right i will put it in the fridge but we gotta pick it up before we go why don't you join in garnet it'll be like a family gaming session this is adorable i absolutely love this time for them kind of messed up but i do think that garnet is gonna invite wayne to the wedding uh-oh alice came over hold on a second it smells great oh no i can't feed you right now i'm sorry alice she left anyways it's okay we'll see you tomorrow all right i'm gonna go ahead and oh my gosh should we woohoo the day before the wedding besties i don't know garnet's kind of a villain i think we should i think we should who was Wayne before the wedding. Oh, that's so messed up. All right, let's go talk to our, um, let's go talk to our hamster before bed while mom and dad are woohooing. Um, and then we'll have Saffron go to bed as well. Fun family game night though. Thanks for playing everyone. Alice, you knocked on my door and walked away. I don't know what you want. She's probably like, I've been missing you and you know, I'm just nervous. <laughs> oh, she's so messed up. It is not okay to play with people's emotions like this. Darn it. I love you, but you're just a bad person. Bad, bad person. All right, at least Saffron's getting her social up, which is very good for us. All right, let's get some good night's sleep. Honestly, Wayne, I guess you can stay as long as you'd like, but um, I'm going to sleep, so. Oh no, Saffron's going through a rebellious phase. Oh no, come on. We got a wedding tomorrow. You better go to sleep. Also, I have no idea where I want the wedding to be. I was kind of thinking it would be on the beach, but maybe that's not a good idea. I'll have to think of where I want to have it. Thank goodness the rain stopped as well. Having a wedding in the rain would definitely
accidentally happen to me and I would be very upset about it. <laughs> First day of fall. Okay, okay. Better go somewhere that's not too cold then. All right, kiddo. Today we're getting married. She's probably a little confused. She's probably thinking we're getting married to her father, but it's actually Alice. Oh, look at her cleaning up after us. Thank you. Thank you, Saffron. All right, she also needs to clean up as well. Let's have you use the restroom, take a shower. We'll take a bath. And then Garnet, I'm going to have you do something that's going to be like relaxing. I guess you want to go play games. You know what? <laughs> have fun doing that before the wedding. Oh, but also we should probably garden and stuff. Let's go ahead and sell all these things. Oh my God. And the hamster cage is so stinky. I'm going to go clean it for her. We don't have time to mess around today. We're getting married. Hopefully that doesn't make us stinky too. All right, let's go ahead and plan an event. We are going to have a wedding. We're going to get married to Alice. Why will it not allow me to click on Alice? I'm very confused. Um, It's not letting me click on Alice. I'm going to have to see what's up with that. I can't believe Major's still alive. Oh my gosh. All right, Harmony. We'll invite Lily. Should I invite the kids? Yeah, I'll invite their kids too. We can invite Mariella. Maybe I shouldn't invite any of my previous flames though. Ooh, that could be a little awkward. Can I invite Major? Yeah, okay. Yeah, why is it not allowing me to um ask Alice out? Are we... Does the game think that I'm not engaged? to her perhaps oh this is gonna upset me besties let me figure it out okay it has us engaged so i'm very confused as to why it is not allowing me to maybe i'll invite her over and see if we can plan the wedding i know that's an, a social interaction yeah it, it like wasn't letting me click on her all right alice is here um let's plan the wedding how do i do that i see elope immediately but i don't want to do that i want to plan the wedding oh besties i'm gonna be so upset if i can't figure this out how do i when did it be in romance? I might have to Google this. I'm gonna have to Google this. BRB. Okay, so someone on the forums is saying that if Alice has work, then it won't allow us to plan. Um, I don't know if I can force her to take the day off though. Does Alice have work? Let me try Let me try doing it again really quick. Let's add an event. Let's plan a wedding. What does this lock mean? Genuinely, I am so... Con oh, do you know what? Maybe I have to break up with all of my other partners. I think I saw somewhere in the comments that I had to do that. Oh, this is gonna be so annoying. Hold on. Do I have to break up with everyone? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I wonder if I can cheat it. Let's open the profile. Can I cheat this? Remove. I'm not boyfriends anymore. This is kind of cheating, but besties it's the only way that's going to make me happy. I hope you understand. That is actually so annoying if this is the solution for it. Nothing makes me want to die more than having to go through every single sim that I have romanced and remove the, uh, am I dating Lily? Okay, no. Remove it from there. I can't believe I'm in a relationship with both of them. They're roommates. I don't think I'm dating anyone else now. I think I'm literally only dating Alice, so we should be good. Okay, I'm only engaged to Alice. Let's try. No, Oh, what's wrong? Why won't it let me plan a wedding? Mm, <laughs> I'm gonna cry, besties. You don't understand. Oh, plan wedding event. It showed up suddenly. Yes? But no, it won't. Ah! What's the issue? I'm gonna I'm gonna have a meltdown. If it's the bride or groom planning the wedding, you don't have to pick the bride slash groom. It auto chooses them. Oh, so does that mean that it's just automatically saying? Maybe I'm just dumb. I might just be dumb, besties. Let's see if we can do this. I'm so sorry. I might have just done that for no reason at all. I feel really silly right now. Okay, I think that's everyone I wanted to invite. Yeah, caterer. Sure, let's hire a caterer. Let's hire a mixologist and we'll hire... No, I don't want a musician. Okay, where are we going to do it at? We could go to the park. I have this beautiful park here, but I don't know if I want to do it there. Oh, it could be really pretty here. Maybe I'll do it here because there's also restrooms. This might be a good one. I'm going to do it here. I think I literally didn't need to break up with everyone. I think it automatically selected my Sims, but I think it's taking us here immediately. I don't think we get to wait. I'm glad I waited for this episode to do it. Okay, I have to make sure everyone's wearing what they need to wear. Okay, so this is Garnet's wedding dress. It's actually supposed to be red. I'm not sure why it's not red, so I'm gonna have to go and cast and fix that. This is what Saffron's wearing. I gave her, like, this cute little princess outfit. I think she looks adorable. And then where is Alice? Okay, yeah, for some reason it changed the colors of the dresses I wanted them to wear, but everyone looks lovely. Even Harmony is dressed up. Oh, this looks great. Oh, and Wayne's here. That's so awkward. Ah! 
<laughs> okay, let me go really quickly. I'm gonna have them put on their correct outfits. Change outfits. Here it is. So this is actually the outfit that I planned for Alice. She curled her hair and she's wearing like a pink dress. And then Garnet, I gave this like really beautiful, stunning, bright red dress for the wedding. Okay, she really wants to stand out. So she's gonna get her wish. All right, I don't know who you are, but you can leave. And then I need to set down a wedding arch and a place for like drinks and stuff. So I'm gonna edit this lot quickly oh this is gonna be so pretty okay, wedding we need the arch honestly this henford arch might be perfect i kind of really like it we could do it like right here in front of the pond i might like move the tables around a little bit actually because yeah we could we can move the chess table maybe um over to this side for now and then we could do the wedding arch like right here okay and then we also need a place to put down the i didn't bring the cake I'm so mad. I'm gonna have to make the wedding cake again. Oh, I forgot. I'm so stupid. Okay, well, I'm gonna put down a quick little pop-up kitchen here so I can make a freaking wedding cake. Oh man, I'm so mad at myself. Okay, we'll put it there for now. Actually, is this even pretty? I don't know. Maybe I'll move it to be here instead. I just want like the background to look nice. I think that's kind of pretty with the bridge in the background. And then we need a bar for drinks and stuff. Um, I think we can just put like a pop-up bar like right Right here and sims can come around and order drinks over here maybe and then this will be the the table for the wedding cake i just <laughs> i just need to make the wedding cake because i'm silly i forgot okay and then i kind of want to set up some like chairs for people to watch the wedding this is like very impromptu i'm so sorry they're not going to be perfect so it'll just be a few chairs right there for the wedding yeah i like that okay perfect now let's go ahead and cook our cake i'm gonna have oh gosh i guess i'll have to have garnet do it i'm so mad at myself for not remembering that. Okay, gourmet meal. Let's do a black and white cake. Okay. And we have to talk to all of our wedding guests, but unfortunately that's not happening. Also, I just noticed that a few of the wedding guests didn't show up. I also invited um the twins. Oh wait, okay, here's okay, never mind. Some people are still loading in, I guess. That's fine. I, I just wanted to see the babies because I wanted Saffron to meet her cousins. But I don't know if they're showing up. Everyone's coming over to talk to her, like, oh, you look so beautiful, you look stunning. We're so happy for you. Oh my god, the baby baby is naked. I repeat, the baby is naked. <laughs> no, besties, I'm putting some clothes on you. I'm so sorry. You cannot, you cannot come to my wedding naked. Not today. You need to wear some clothes. Is that, is that really? Okay, these are their formal outfits. You know what? That's fine. Saffron, come over here and meet your cousins. These are, these are your little baby cousins. You need to meet them. Wait, I'm sorry. Is that Agatha Crumplebottom? What is Agatha going to be doing? We have our bartender over here, Duan, but I guess Agatha, you're just going to come to my wedding and cross stitch, Agatha really oh my goodness garnet bestie i need you to make your wedding cake i'm so sorry you need to do this for me oh my god you're making out with your roommate at our wedding are you kidding me right now alice <gasps> oh besties i think we have a reason for not marrying her i think wayne saw that and wayne's gonna come over and be like did you know that your future wife is literally making out with her current roommate oh i think that's the drama that's the tea that's the story there i was wondering how we were gonna we were gonna say that how we were gonna make it happen where they're not actually getting together but that's it that's it right there she's secretly in love with her roommate behind our back mariella's like oh i'm really sad she is really sad i bet that they're like like a thing and she's upset that i'm marrying her yadira is sad too i'm like breaking so many hearts here also can we just look at carmen and see how absolutely beautiful she is our sister is so stunning i love her okay saffron loves her little cousins can y'all let garnet finish cook cooking baking this cake besties i really feel silly that i didn't do this at home come on finish baking i did bring a caterer right isn't agatha supposed to make us food this is kind of funny that i have this kitchen set up over here it's fine it's out of the way okay pause nobody touched this cake cake must be in the center i thought someone was touching it i was gonna scream i was ready to scream okay add a wedding topper also nothing to see here but agatha is literally hugging my girl okay add the wedding topper please thank you okay moving the cake over to to where it belongs perfect all right thank you agatha thank you all right we need to eat some food betrothed flirt with each other okay i'm supposed to flirt so let's kiss her hands and maybe maybe do some flirty stuff we need to talk to wayne at some point so he can tell us what alice did behind our back passionate kiss oh my gosh this is gonna be so dramatic all right let's go where's wayne we need to say hi to wayne wait what just happened negative hearts are you kidding me is she already feeling guilty wayne where did wayne go oh my gosh weddings are always so chaotic what's the sense 
sentiment I just got with her. Deeply connected? Yeah, right. Okay, apparently Wayne is going on a hike. Are you kidding me right now? All right, please be back for the wedding. <laughs> Maybe he'll text us what happened. And that way, that's that's how we find out. Let's go say hi to our sister-in-law. Let's uh, let's tell a dramatic story. Maybe thank her for coming. The kids are so cute, by the way. I love them. Okay, the main goal is to get married. So I think we're going to go ahead and do that here in a second. Are we ready? Get married to Alice. Let's do it. Why is she so angry right now? Oh, she is ruining our wedding. She is so angry. This is it. This is why we don't get married. How do I stand up to her? I don't know how I leave her at the altar. Is that like an option that I'm missing, Beth? I'm not actually sure. I, I want to make sure that I don't accidentally marry her. <laughs> Otherwise, if I do marry her, we'll say for the storyline that they um they got divorced immediately. Like it didn't work or something. Our kid is over here on the monkey bars. Honestly, go off, kiddo. Live your best life. Oh my gosh, she is so mad at us. Do you see this? Is she like here because her roommate's kind of like, yo, please don't get married. Maybe that's it. All right, come on, let's go. We have to go get married. <laughs> come on, hurry up. She's so mad right now though. Oh God. Oh man, how do I leave her at the altar? You don't want to come get married to me? Come on, get married. Okay, it's happening. Are the guests going to come over here? She's storming over here. This is evil. Okay, I don't want to actually get married though. Call off the wedding. Oh my God, we're calling it off. We're calling it off. The drama of it all. This is gonna ruin our relationship. <gasps> Carnage just called off the wedding with Alice. We did it. Oh no, I feel so bad. But also Alice was being kind of a, mm, if you know what I mean. So do I feel that bad? No, she had it coming. He is really yelling at her. Oh my gosh, the drama of it all. I'm living for it. Harmony, get out of the way. Oh my God. Take the first slice. Wait, are you telling me I can still get the cake? Oh no, it just wants me to, to take the first slice, but I'm not gonna do it. Oh man. Do we have a new sentiment with her actually? Infuriated about canceled wedding. How dare Garnet humiliate Alice in front of everyone at their wedding? Alice may have a hard time keeping calm around Garnet for a while. Oh my god. We did it. We left them at the altar. That's it. That is so sad. I feel really sad about that. I've never done that before, but I guess it's what needed to happen, right? Oh, wait, is that your friend? I'm pretty sure that's Robin. I think that's Saffron's friend. She's just over here right now. Saffron's like, I don't even want anything to do with this. Wayne's over here on a hike. Maybe we should have Garnet go say hi to him. Oh wait, actually, he's coming over. Chatting with with Wayne. He came over to us autonomously. Be like, yeah, I called off the wedding, but thank you for coming. I appreciate it. And thank you for telling me about what Alice was doing because I wouldn't have known. So I really appreciate that. He's sad. I wonder if he's sad about her getting married to someone else. Like, he's just like, wow, I really wanted to be with you. Oh, you have to pee? Maybe you should go pee, bestie. It's fine. I don't mind. These kids are a menace, by the way. Look at what they're doing to this beautiful wedding venue. Also, I'm a little sad. Oh, there's another. I'm gonna grab a serving for... No, I can't. I can't take my own piece. Well, let's remove the wedding topper and then we'll take a piece. How about that? Because I still want to eat this cake. I was here for a reason. Call everyone to a meal. Come on, everyone. It's cake time. Man, this was really dramatic. Mariella and Alice having a moment before our wedding. Wayne seeing it, telling Garnet, and then Garnet being like, I am absolutely not getting married to you. You've been in love with your roommate this whole time. How could you lie to us? Also, why is this smelly person here? Jamel, I don't know who you are. You're not you're not here. Please leave. Why is he here eating our food? What even is this? Capri salad? Okay. Made by Agatha. I can't believe Agatha was our caterer. Alice, I'm just really upset about this whole thing. How could you do that to us? Dodged a bullet from getting cold feet. Just narrowly avoided a very serious relationship. Oh my gosh, she's happy that she didn't. Now she's going to chat with Wayne again. You can talk to Wayne. Why is he sitting over there doing it though? <laughs> um, Maybe I can get him to vote for us? Y'all, do you want to vote for me? Hello? Oh yeah, I broke up with him. I have to ask him to be my boyfriend again. Oh, that's gonna be awkward at some point. Okay, let's uh promote our policies, try to cheer him up, and then we will trick him with empty promises. <laughs> I am always on the politician job, okay? I need to get these votes. How many votes do I even need? I need two more, so I'll secure one from him, and then maybe I can ask Lily to vote for us. Hey, Lily. Are you voting for me? Yo, thanks, Wayne. Appreciate it. Anyways, hello. Whoops, I debated politics 
votes from the wrong side with Lily. That's fine. I don't think it actually matters. Hello, I'm trying to get a vote over here. Oh, look, there's Carmen. I've been looking for Carmen all day. Hi, Carmen. It's good to see you. Anyways, Lily, it's good seeing you. Sister-in-law, would you consider voting for me? I know that whole wedding thing was a disaster, but I promise my career is not a disaster. I'm actually a great politician, okay? Yes, okay, it worked. We can get promoted then. Perfect. All the kids are over here making an absolute mess out of everything. Oh my goodness. At least she's like friends with her cousins now. Let's keep getting to know them. Y'all are just being very bad. I just want you to know that. <laughs> You're just being bad. Oh, Eliana is wild. Makes sense. Anyways, I think that this wedding is over. I don't even know where everyone else went. I'm just hanging out here. It's kind of awkward because Mariella's here and that's the one that Alice was making out with earlier. There's gonna be so much drama. Wait, we still got a medal? A silver medal for our wedding? Are you kidding me right now? Wait, I have a new sentiment with Wayne. Oh, we adore him again. Wait, that's kind of cute. I like that. All right, it's time to go home. Let's go. Thanks for hanging out. You know, I was thinking that Garnet was gonna be a little bit upset about the results of that wedding, but she was actually happy about it and confident. She said she dodged a bullet. That's interesting. I thought she'd be like heartbroken. All right, well, it was a wedding. It just wasn't a beautiful one. Kiddo, let's get you ready for bed, all right? Go talk to your hamster and stuff. It was kind of nice that her friend showed up. She got to hang out with Robin a little bit more. Yeah, Alice isn't mad at us, but she definitely doesn't have a romance bar with us anymore, so that's kind of sad. <laughs> I do feel some minor guilt about that whole thing. Let's take a bath with soaks after that. Let's do rose petals. We deserve it after that long day. What an absolute disaster. I think it took me longer to set up the wedding than to actually do the wedding <laughs> because I couldn't figure out what I was doing wrong. That's kind of silly. All right. And Saffron, let's work on your smartness, your whiz kid. We need to play chess or read with an adult. I don't know if I really want to do that though. It was a suggestion, but I don't know if I really care that much. <laughs> when is our birthday anyways? Oh, her birthday is coming up on Thursday. Okay. So she's going to be a teenager soon. That's kind of exciting. We have so much fun things to look forward to. All right. Let's get you both some good nights of sleep. Why are you up? It's too noisy. Oh my God. Are the neighbors? Oh, I'm going to go yell at them. I swear. Me and my kid are trying to sleep. Shut up. Yeah, you. Please stop. Okay, good. He said he was being inconsiderate. Let's go back to sleep then. Oh, we got some money from child support. So wait, still is paying child support. That's good. Good morning. You can clean this up. Garnet is uncomfortably hungry. Okay. We're going to have you go to work though. We're going to try to get you promoted. And you, kiddo, I think you might actually become an A student today if you work hard. That would be wonderful. Then maybe we can both celebrate after getting promotions at school and at work. She loves gaming. She's doing that in all her free time. Ooh, Garnet needs a new challenge at work. How does she ask the boss? Let's demand a challenge. Is that bad? Performance gain medium. Yes. I feel like Garnet would demand things, you know? Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. Major passed away. So the last time we saw him was at our wedding that failed. That is kind of tragic if you think about it. Oh man. I was like wondering how he was still alive and kicking. All right, kiddo. You are an A student now. I am really proud of you. Let's get your homework done. And yay, we got promoted to elder states person. We now make 231 per hour. We got a huge bonus, which is great because we need to pay the bills. Look, I know you want to crawl into bed and cry, but we have some bills to pay. Come on, up and at them. You're having a not so great day, are you? Alexander Goth is asking me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alexander Goth and his receding hairline is asking me to be the dance team captain. I don't think so, bestie. I'm literally, what level am I? I'm a level nine politician. I don't think so. But we only have one more promotion left. That's kind of exciting. We do not have any dinner left, so I'm gonna have to cook something tonight. Let's do some French toast. Honestly, like IRL French toast sounds amazing right now. I would love that. <laughs> French toast for dinner. Also, I'm changing you out of these clothes because they don't match. I think she's doing okay. She's just sad about Major, which honestly, that's very valid. Maybe we should check on Harmony to make sure she's doing okay. Oh, are you going into your kid's room to talk to her while she's doing her homework because you're sad. Oh my gosh. Wait, this is kind of adorable. <laughs> she's not feeling well, so she's going in to get some comfort from Saffron. Okay, but don't distract her though. Um, hello? No, you cannot come in. I do not want to talk to you. Decline to feed. This is peak townie fashion, by the way, like her outfit. Yeah, do not disturb me. Thank you. Are you going to go play with her hamster? 
sister. Oh my gosh, she must be really sad to be willingly playing with a rodent. That is wild. And she's gonna go back into her bed and cry. Honestly, I'm not even gonna stop you. Hey neighbor, I'm bored. Wanna hang out? Um, no, I'm not in the mood. I'm really not in the mood. I'm actually curious what will happen if I invite over Wayne and ask him to be my boyfriend again, if it will complete this have had eight boyfriends or girlfriends thing, because that might actually be kind of nice. I feel like she regrets leaving Wayne and is feeling lonely right now and sad. So she'd probably want that comfort. Oh no, he is enraged. I'm not sure what's wrong with him. Are you okay? Let's try to calm him down. Maybe he's still upset about yesterday and the fact that I was marrying someone else. I don't know. Let's try to brighten his day a little bit. Look, I'm sorry you're in a bad mood, but you really need to calm down, okay? I'm too sad to ask him out again. Oh, this is bad. Well, let's ask him for some advice then. Maybe he'll put us in a better mood. Come on, you're with Wayne. Get in a better mood. Maybe you all can play a game together again. That might cheer us all up. Family game night. Come on, Wayne, join us. You smell. Oh, even my own kid left me. It's just me playing games by myself now. Never mind, that didn't work. Um, maybe we can tell a joke about vampires. That's the only joke we can tell right now. Look, it's getting late. Are you just gonna go cry in your bed? Oh my gosh. <sighs> this is so difficult. Try it out. Fine, you know what? I'm done. I'm not gonna try to get back together with Wade right now. Oh no, these people are being so noisy. I'm gonna send Saffron over to pound on the door. I think she probably could do it. She is angry. Hello, I'm trying to sleep here. I'm a child. Complain angrily. Will you shut up, please? Okay, he said sorry. Good. Come on, something has to get us into a better mood. Become partners in crime? Oh my gosh. I don't think Garnet's very mischievous. Come on, Wayne, can you please calm us down? You also need to calm down, to be honest, bud. Can I give a gloomy compliment? Maybe that will work. Okay, he's in a better mood now. He did not like that. Okay, ask for advice. I don't know. I don't know. I think she's gonna be too sad for a while because of losing someone. That is so unfortunate. I would love to like woohoo or something just to make her happy. Oh my gosh, I didn't even notice this. The sink was broken. Garnet, you gotta take better care of your house. This is dirty. I'm gonna make Saffron clean it up though. Just too sad. Oh, we're energetic. We're energetic. No, 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 no. Don't leave, don't leave. Beguile, beguile, beguile. Don't go pee. Beguile. Here we go, here we go. It's happening. Let's ask him if he's single. I think Garnet is now going to start doing that because of what just happened at her wedding. She's a little traumatized. Okay, let's ask him out again. Let's see if this works. I'm sorry about what happened yesterday, but I think I would really like to be with you again. Okay, he said yes. Cheeb. Did that work? It did! Have eight boyfriends and girlfriends. Okay, that makes me really happy. Um, I'm gonna go to sleep now, though. <laughs> And I think that's actually a really good time to end today's Let's Play. Um, we just went through a lot. In the end, I do think Garnet and Wayne are going to get back together and they're going to co-parent very well. But that's not going to happen until they're old. So they're going to slowly try to rebuild their relationship. Anyways, after that dramatic burnout, I was like, I don't know how I'm going to make it up to where why Garnet would not get married to Alice. But then Alice went ahead and did it herself. She made the story. I kind of like how it played out, though. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed that as well. And other than that, thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as it really helps the channel out. But until next time, I love you all a lot and I will see you in the next one. Take care, everyone. Thank you for watching my YouTube video. I don't know what I'm singing. This is my outro, but thanks. See you next time. Love you. Bye.